if you want to create a talking head character like me with a moving 3D in-depth background and create an amazing short story or cartoon channel and earn more than $5,000 per month effortlessly, make sure you watch this video till the end. And towards the end, I'm going to give you a surprise tip. So don't miss out and let's begin with the tutorial. Step one, create the story scenes. So for that, first I'll be using chat.openai.com. I'm using chat GPT 3.5 version, which is a free version. In this prompt box, you'll have to give you a prompt. My prompt goes like this. Like this, write a short story of a young boy who invents a robot. And then I have mentioned in 500 words. Once I'm ready, I'll just go and send message. I just want to make eight scenes now. You can make more. Okay, now ChatGPT will give me scene by scene prompt. So I have precisely got eight such scenes part two. So we will now go to the next part where we will be creating the voiceover for each scene. We will be creating the voiceover. For that, we are going to use 11labs.io. I will be giving all these websites link in the description. So do not worry about it. All I need to do is I need to go back to the scenes and i need to just copy the scene and head back to 11 labs just paste it now you will have to choose whether you want a male voice or a female voice for this particular story i want a male voice i will go to this drop down option here i get different male and female voices you can choose as per your need now let me show you some more adjustments here if you go to this voice setting option well, I am using a free account. So even if you're using a free account, just need to sign up with your Gmail or email account. You will get all these options open for you. Okay, 35 to 40 is the stability which I use. You just need to go to this generate button. Step three, creating the prompt for making the image, generating the text to image. For this, we will be using gravityright.com. I will be giving this link in the description. So first, we will have to go to uh, gravityright.com and start for free option. You can log in with your Gmail or email account. Now here in the left hand side widget, you will get different types of options. Here for us, we will be creating AI art. So for that, we will go to image prompts and go to AI art first write the subject what you for which you want the image now for this i have already taken the description of max so i will copy this i will just paste it and here you will have to type the action which the subject should be doing now environment i want it to be indoor lighting indoor studio lighting and here you have different art forms which you can use i will use pixar 3d pixar 3d and create content i have got four such prompts let me try one by one i will take the second prompt first copy it so we are done with our part three prompt generation now let us head over to the next part where we will be creating the images out of these prompt for the purpose of this video, I am going to use Leonardo AI and Canva Magic. So first I will head over to Leonardo AI. Go to the link given in the description. Go for launch app option in order to get the access. Once you get a verification mail in your mail ID, you will have to go to launch app. I am whitelisted and give your mail ID and name and count me in. This is all you will have to do once you finish this process go to this dashboard where we will be creating our magic we will be going to ai image generation i will have to paste that entire script which i have made watch carefully you will have to select one style i will i will use 3d animation style and here in the left hand side you have a couple of options one is you can choose how many images you want so i am choosing two for the time being Every single day you have 150 tokens, so it is good enough to create a complete video out of these images. And you will have to select the ratio. So for me, I am selecting wide, wide screen ratio, 16 is to 9. Here in gradient scale, you'll have to keep 7, between 7 to 8. 
so i give 7 if you have any reference image which i'm going to upload once the first image is generated will be uploading here for now i will just go and generate and let's see how the outcome comes well i have got these two images if you like it then continue if you don't like you can further generate but somehow i feel that this is okay so i will go to smoothing upscaling option you can directly download this image from here now my first image is ready similarly i will take the description of robo bunny for next image generation i will use canva so for this i will be using the first prompt which has been given by gravity right so i will head over to canva and i will take a widescreen ratio you can use canva pro for free for 30 days the link will be given in the description below come a little downwards go to this apps option and here you type magic media and enter and then go to this first option magic media here you have two options either you can create an image or a video for the first time i am using the image option and paste the prompt here now you can choose the kind of image you want i want a dreamy image and i will also select the aspect ratio as widescreen and create your image this will give you four different variants so you can choose from all these four variants well i have got all these four options so one by one i will take it on the screen i'll just select it right click and set it as background this is my first image this is my second image i will go to add page and i will take third image as well and finally i will take the fourth image so all these four images are there with me and I, I can i can compare this is the these are the images from canva and these are the images from leonardo ai do let me know in the comment section below which one do you like the most i will be generating the second prompt so i will go to this robo bunny well like this you will have to make all the images for each a each of the scenes i have got eight scenes so i should be creating eight such images so we are ready with our two characters now let us move to the next part where we will be animating this character now we will go to character animation for that we will go to did and we will try it for free so log in with your gmail and email account and go to create video from here or go to create video from here here i will have to go to add option in this software you will be getting 20 credits go to add and let us see if did can detect this face so go to this upload media option and from here you you select those audios which we have just created so i'll be selecting the scene one mp3 and open it and then generate the video it will take one credit so i'll just go and generate okay so once it is done you go and download next step is image to video for this we will be using pika labs where we will have to join their discord server so for that go to pika labs home and join beta pika labs is a free to free tool and then it will ask you to accept the invitation for discord so accept invitation if you already have a discord account then it will automatically lead in, lead inside discord account if you don't have then it will ask you to create one in easiest way so you can do that next is after you go there you go to the speaker lab option and go for any of join in any of these generate option i am going to generate seven you can choose any and here there are two options one by prompt itself you can create generate video and the second option is you can upload image we will be going for the second option since we already have the image and according to me that gives the best effect okay so for that go to this prompt box forward slash and create and then take this prompt box fine now you go to this plus one more option and go to image option here you will have to drag and drop the image so i have already taken the image scene by scene so i will be just dragging and dropping the image and once you drop it you cannot keep the prompt area blank so you will have to give a prompt so i'll give well i have given this prompt walking smiling i will just go to this download button and download it it will be downloaded in my desktop like this you'll have to create all the videos for 
all of your images okay now i want to show you another software by which you can make the animation genmo.ai this is again is having certain free uh, trials so you can go for sign up to create you can sign up with google or gmail or email account next here you have three options either you can create the image by giving a prompt copy it and paste it i will go to in, go to the create option and paste the prompt here take the spec ratio for me it is 16 is to 9 and then generate image this is what ai has derived okay you can even go directly to frame by frame making video out of it this is pretty good they will be they mainly animate the background so i will just go ahead and download it now let us go to this make a new video option i will go to upload option here straight away i will be uploading my assets you can use this brush tool in order to select the objects whom you want to animate and go to make video and let's see how the video turns out to be and we will go for download the third option would be leopix.com i will be leaving the link in the description here you can sign in you will have to sign up with gmail or email account in leopix we will go to upload option and we will be uploading the image and it will automatically animate the entire path go to this animation style there are different types of style these things you can change as per your requirement once this is done you can go to this export button and directly export now let us move forward to the next part where we will be creating animated subtitles next we will be creating subtitle for that go to any video editing software it could be CapCut or any other software i am using movavi video suit here i will go to this background option and here i will take a solid green color you can take any green colored background if there is a reason why you will understand a little later first go to this background option and drag and drop a green background if it is not downloaded you will have to download by clicking on this top right hand side arrow button file import we will be taking the entire folder i will take entire audio folder then go to files and all these audios you will have to drag like this once this is done go to export option it should be in mp4 give the name select the directory it should be in high quality and start rendering once rendering is done head over to invid.io this website i will be giving the link in the description then go to create video option then upload the file so i'll be taking the file which i have just rendered with the green screen then go to subtitle option from top fourth option and go to auto subtitle for me the language is english you can check any other language now since the subtitle is ready if you want to translate the subtitle go to translate option and you can change in any other language including hindi go to this backwards arrow and go to style option here you can check different types of style go and do done export the video go to this download option select mp4 and download it we will have to just assemble all this so i will just assemble everything in movavi itself you can use any and go to file option add the folder all the videos which you have okay. now we will have to just assemble one by one now to increase each video length you can just clone the video put it in the right hand side select the video and go to these clip properties option and here you just need to reverse it now if i play why did i do it i'll just show you it kind of shows the, the repetition or amplification of this video clip and same thing you can just clone and right click clone and just remove reverse so like that you can increase the quality uh, increase the video length without compromising on the quality so once these are assembled now you will have to go to this plus button see it properly go to this plus button and go to add track 
Now you just drag and drop this subtitle option here. I have uploaded my video green screen video over the main video and I have just right clicked and just go and detach audio. Now the next step select the video option. Go to these four uh, dots and then four boxes in the bottom all tools option. From video option go to chroma key and just release get rid of this part. If I talk about this part if you want to get rid of this part as well then go to crop option and simply crop it from here apply. Now if I play this see there is no watermark other than the Max a young boy with a passion for space and adventure. Keeping this video layer selected go to position option and here you can just drag it a little bit downwards. It's as simple as that make sure this green grid comes at the middle of the frame. Now once everything is set you can go to this export option give a name to the project select the directory make sure high uh, quality is selected and simply start rendering and this is the final result max a young boy with a passion for space and adventure works tirelessly in his garage to create robo bunny a unique robot rabbit companion i am robo bunny a marvel of engineering and design my sleek metallic body boasts a shimmering silver finish that elegantly complements my soft fluffy ears my most captivating feature is my expressive LED eyes, capable of changing colors to convey emotions and facilitate communication with my dearest friend Max. With graceful movements powered by wheels, I can navigate various terrains effortlessly. I communicate through friendly beeps and whirs, a language Max has mastered to understand me fully. Max reveals RoboBunny, an extraordinary creation with fluffy ears and expressive LED eyes. He programs it to be his loyal companion. On a starry night, Max shares his dream of exploring the universe with RoboBunny, who responds with enthusiastic beeps. Max and his parents convert an old spaceship into the Stellar Voyager, their vessel for intergalactic adventures. Max and RoboBunny embark on their first mission, venturing toward a mesmerizing nebula in the Milky Way. Inside the nebula, Max and RoboBunny witness a breaking cosmic ballet of colors and lights, filling them with awe. While exploring the nebula, Max detects faint signals and navigates the stellar voyager to a hidden planet within. They make contact with a friendly alien civilization. Max and RoboBunny spend days on the alien planet, exchanging knowledge and stories with the inhabitants. They bid farewell and return to their suburban town, ready for more adventures in the vast universe. If you like this video please 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 do subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet and please consider to give me a like one small request please do share my content with your friends and family so that i can thrive in every single day to create new videos like this for you all thank you so very much for staying here with me i'll come back with some fun tutorial next week till then stay safe and stay legendary.